Look, it was great to get started in the in the Guinness Pro 14 on uh, on Friday night. It was you know it was it was great to have the the few fans in that w that we had and and they were um, were great. It was really great to ha have um, someone other than just the the subs giving the guys a bit of encouragement. And yeah, look, it, it's great to get started. Um, uh, you, you know, a new season, fresh start, and um, and get going, and and t to get a win first up at home is is really important. The ambition that the the players showed on Friday night to you know to, to keep the ball alive in that transition where we um, you know Gilly got us a, t a turnover from a kick and, a, and away we go and 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 Stu making his breaks and. And, and just the ambition that the, the players um, displayed was was great, and that probably, you know, with Mikey James and Stu in the middle of the park with their, their youthful exuberance, that probably rubbed off on 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 everyone. So, look, we you know we want to play, we want to we want to kick the ball and 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 go at teams and attack space. Um, so yeah, it's nice it's it's nice to have passages of play where we play like that, but. Um, we're also well aware that we've got to have more than one way to play um, the game, so we've got to keep developing. To, to see um, four former Ernst pupils out there on, on Friday night was, you know, for, for me having had the involvement with them at, at school um, in the recent uh, past was, was, you know, like that is satisfying. I know there's a, a, a huge satisfaction amongst all the um, past pupils and their former teachers and their their teammates and classmates and the current um, pupils at the school so it's been a long time since since they've had that many guys um, play together for, for Ulster so it's um, yeah it's really great to see and and look I thought they all did really well I thought Dave you know stepping up in his first game um, you know he just looked like he was to the man of born he was there were no there were no qualms he was into it and I thought he did really well so Mikey and James have had a wee bit more experience but obviously Mikey was getting a start at 10 which he he hasn't had a huge amount and um, you know he, he made a good fist of that as well and um, so look hopefully we, we you know hopefully we see them out there a lot more over the future but you know there's a lot of other young guys that 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 um, that are doing really well and, and pushing as well. We're in a, you know, we're really excited about the the youth in the squad and, and how they're driving things on at the moment. Smooth moving, Stuart Moore. Uh, Osprey's, you, you know, off to the perfect start to 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 win on the weekend on the road, and I think it was their first win on the road for, you know, well over a year. So um, we're under no illusion. It's a really really tough match. It's great to get a win game one, but that means nothing if you don't back it up in week two and we know how what a physical challenge they bring and they've got some you know some of the top rugby players in the world um, so you know it's, it's going to be a big challenge it always is going over there and um, and you know it's really important that we improve our performance from Friday night and if, if we don't we're going to be uh, disappointed.